Hey guys, what's going on? It's your girl Godly. I am bringing you breaking news. Just released this morning, George Zimmerman. All right, now for those of y'all who know him, you should. I can't think of a single person who doesn't know him or remember him. But in February 2012, he was actually acquitted of the death of Trayvon Martin. Do you remember the the teenager who had been shot and brought about this whole law in Florida about stand your ground, this, that, and the other? Um, Then he, you know, in September 2013, he threatened his estranged wife and her father. November 2013, Zimmerman's girlfriend called the police saying that he was threatening her with a shotgun. Now, he is just the bottom of the barrel to me. He is just absolutely trash. You know what I mean? Just, I, I, I don't have any respect for him whatsoever. So anyways, he is scheduled to fight in a pay-per-view fight for celebrity boxing. And guess who he will be fighting against? Dark Man X. As you and I know him, DMX. I am so excited for this. Like I said, I can not stan zimmerman and i absolutely love dmx you know he used to be the shit back in the day and i still listen to his music you know i just you can't think of rap without thinking of dmx that voice oh my god anyways a little bit of info dmx is 43 george zimmerman is 30 now they say that dmx is out for blood now that's a quote he is out for blood but Zimmerman has been in training for a couple of months now and so I found it funny in some of the articles that I was reading is that he said before the whole quote-unquote incident with Trayvon Martin I'm just so glad that that's you know the lack of respect you know that he gives to the whole incident what have you But anyways, um, he's been in training for several months. Now, I guess apparently whenever this hit the circuit or what have you, um, the gentleman who is in control of all this, who is setting all the fights up, whatever. I don't know of any of the, you know, other individuals who are fighting, what have you. But he got close to 15,000 people, 15,000 emails from different applicants who wanted a chance to fight Zimmerman. I know for a fact, like, sign me up. You know, I can't imagine. And I, I'm actually surprised that it was only 15000 you know. But anyways, um, I have a couple of issues with this whole little thing. Are we seriously giving this dude more publicity? I mean, seriously? Like I said, he is just scum. He's trash. He's the bottom of the barrel, just gross, like white stuff on top of chicken shit kind of stuff you know i hope dmx beats the living dog shit out of him i also hope dmx isn't fucked up on heroin that day or whatever he's been on i know dmx has had his struggles um he's been through this been through that but you know i've always liked dmx i've always just thought he was a great guy um you know i thought he was an excellent rapper like i said that voice so anyways um like i said i've never watched celebrity boxing And I found one of the things to be funny is that whenever all this, you know, started circulating, and I don't know if you actually can throw in your ideas as far as who you want to fight, but George Zimmerman actually picked Kanye West to fight. Now, that probably would have been so much better for, you know, for publicity-wise, it probably been so much better. I can't think of hardly anybody who likes George Zimmerman or Kanye West. You know, it probably would have been better. But, like I said, DMX is out for blood. So, anyways, I wanted to read y'all a quote that he had said. And this is strictly his quote. Quote, I'm going to beat the living fuck out of him. I am breaking every rule in boxing to make sure I fuck him right up. Once I am done with him, I'm going to whip my dick out and piss on him right in his motherfucking face. Zimmerman is a piece of shit and that's what he needs to drink. What? Are you serious? That's the end of the quote, obviously. Are you serious? Like, come on, D. I swear you better not show up all cracked out of your mind and stuff. So, anyways, like I said, it's going to be a pay-per-view fight. Um, The details aren't set to be released until next Wednesday. So, I guess a week from today. But, like I said, the time, date, and details won't be released until next 
Wednesday. So it's going to be really interesting. Um, I can imagine how many people are. I I know I'm going to be there. I'm going to, you know, I'm going to be watching it. Shit. I'm going to have my popcorn, my beer. Like, no, this is, this is going to be bigger than the Super Bowl. You heard? Anyways, that's what I got for you guys. Let me know what your thoughts, your comments, concerns are. That's what I got. Till next time. Peace out.